all and welcome back to my channel kids of heart toys and today i am doing a throwback thursday i have not done a throwback thursday in quite a long time uh, but i thought i would um bring back those videos at least once in a while i have a few cool things a few toys from the past i would like to showcase and show so here is one of them i wanted to do um and this is a package i just received from eBay, I'm really excited. It is the Fisher Price Movie Viewer Theater, and this is a toy that was made back in the early 70s. It is definitely a toy I've always wanted, <laughs> but you know my family couldn't afford it at the time. But um, I got a really good deal on it with an auction on eBay. So it came with this movie theater right here, and all of those cassette tapes. So what this was was you have these cartridges i'll just take this out and show you they look like this and they would they have a little sticker on them so this one is a snoopy tennis classic from your good sport charlie brown and you see that says 1958 <laughs> but um i believe anyway it says ages three to ten i believe this was made i even have the box <laughs> But I don't, I don't know. I think this, it said in the auction this was 1973. So, anyway. So, you have these cassettes, these movie cassettes. And this here is what they also had was a personal viewer. And you stick the tape. This has Cinderella in it. You stick the tape in there. And I don't know if I could even show you with, if I, uh, can you see? Very, not very well. <laughs> That's why I got the movie viewer, because I'm like, then I can show you. But if I try to center it, you see how it's moving? That Cinderella. Of course, it's not working. Let's see. I'll try to get her. I'm trying to get her more clear, but it's about as best I can do. These are very old, so. But as you can see, it's moving. And it's moving. So that's the point of it. That you could make these things move. And like I said, it's not good quality here because, you know, you have to look through this little peak hole. <laughs> That's why I got this, because now I get to show you, it'll be, you know, in a bigger, larger thing. They are still don't look very nice because, hello, these are, what, 70s, over 30 years old, at least. You know, 70s, 80s, 90s, yeah. They're almost, they're, actually, they're over 40 years old, so what do you expect? <laughs> what do you expect from, <laughs> so anyway, they're they're not, they don't make noise they don't make any noise except for the sound of this thing moving when you're turning it but um it's silent little cartoon clips or video clips well not video clips <laughs> movie clips okay and um see as you can see through here you see that little film strip there and the film strips right through there so it goes inside and i'll show you goes inside here right here and this thing has a handle that attaches to this this little thing here and that's what makes the film turn and when it does it fast enough it makes a movie it makes the action um so you have to crank it a lot <laughs> but the cool thing is you can make the movie go forwards or you can make it go backwards i mean back in the 70s this was a, an amazingly cool toy oh man i'm telling you i really wanted one of these so bad but like I said, they were too pricey for our family back then. So anyhow, I was able to get it now. So I'm excited. And um, the cool thing about this is that you can view it here or you can flip a little thing here and you can actually show it on your wall. I don't know if I can show you. See this little thing right here can flip and it can sh you can show it on your wall, which is really cool. Um... But I don't, I, I think I might do that, but I'll use a, like a, I'm so really close. I'll use this paper to show you. But yeah, it's really cool. I mean, back in the day, this was a really cool toy. So I'm going to show off the light. I'm sorry about my quality of my video. It will definitely go down because of the light lighting. But I wanted you to be able to see, to see what's in there. So I'm going to put Snoopy back in. And if you, oh, sorry about my, Snoopy just, well, can I get him in? Snoopy slides in. He's supposed to, just like that. Now he's in. I'm going to go shut off the light. And then I will show you what happens. And I know my quality film's going to go down. I apologize. It's just how it is. So I'm going to turn this on. And there you go. Um, don't know. Do I have my light on? Because I see a light. I shouldn't see a light. I wonder if my 
Hang on just a moment. I'm going to try to fix my camera. Let me see. Whoop. I don't want to do that. Okay. Hello, I'm, I'm back. Here. So I kind of figured out what happened. This bright light you see, like right there, that's the light bulb that's inside. It's a light bulb that is making the light come through the, the projection screen. There's nothing I can do about that. So I'm going to tip this down so it looks like he has a sun. <laughs> So hopefully you can just see the rest of it because it is cool. Um, let me see. So there's a crank on the side. So you just crank it. And look, he does action. So there he is. It just looks like it's sunny out. But that's the light bulb. And um, it has a, um, a dial that you can make the movie. See how the movie's now blurry? You can clear up the movie. I have a feeling I already did the best I could do it. Which is... Kind of hard to tell considering my camera's not... Okay, that's about as best I'm going to do with it. Like I said, they're very old, very old film and a very old toy. But you see? See the action? So this is Snoopy, the tennis star, playing tennis. I'm going to try to pull my... There. There we go. So, I mean, it's right. it looks cooler in person, of course, but... But then what you can do here is turn it the other way and it does it backwards. See? It does it backwards so you can go really fast. You can't go that fast to be honest. Or you can go backwards fast because, you know, the crank is old and stuff. But is that cool? So it plays a good, um, it plays a good amount of film. It's, it's a pretty, it's like couple minute video I'd say or maybe a minute video not video film strip whatever <laughs> I'm used to saying video what do you want and that's the end and if I do it like that you'll see the light bulb so it's not worth it to do that I'm gonna move this over here so it's out of the way one thing you can also do like I said you can either have it do that or you can do it on here I'm going to try to oh yeah look at that I'm gonna move my little video tapes here I'm going to move this camera over so you can see. See that? I have this on, um, let's see. Yeah. I can't do it much better than that, really. I'm going to try to see if I can make this clearer. Probably not. So you could actually put this on the wall if I had one available, which I don't. So this is just a piece of paper. I can't. I'm really trying to clear that up so it doesn't look so bad, but. I don't think anything's going to help it at this point. This is about best I'm going to get it. Whoops. I'm sorry about my... Eh. The only thing is, I can't I can't turn the crank and have you see it. <laughs> but you can see that it's on that anyway. I mean, I could do this, but you're not going to see it really well because of my hand. But anyway, you can see that it plays on that paper fine. So you can see a little bit of it. So you have two ways to play this thing. And you can make it... I mean, you can... You can make the thing bigger. You can make it bigger, like a bigger screen. I mean, you just have to fix this thing. See? And it comes out clearish. <laughs> so, yeah. I, I just can't do a lot with it. <laughs> and I can't. There. There we go. I made it bigger and I turned the crank. So, yeah. So, isn't that cool? So, you can watch it on your wall. So, anyway, I did that. <laughs> I'm going to go back to here even though it's terrible with the uh, bulb. I don't know if I'm going to show you all of the, the, um, you know, the videos and stuff. But it's just, it, the light bulb is horrible. You can see the light bulb really clear on my video camera, on my iPad, and it's not good. But, alright, so that's Snoopy. I can show you a few of these anyway. I got Roadrunner. I can show you. I have, you can't, you can't see the things. I have Roadrunner. I have gummy bears. There's a gummy bear one. I have... This is not the Rescuers. This is... It has Rescuers on it, but this isn't... This is um, Mickey and the Beanstalk. I have a Sesame Street one. Numbers. Um, I have Winnie the Pooh with Tigger. Let's see. Uh, can I show you? Yep. Winnie the Pooh and Tigger 2. And I think this one is the Rescuers. It doesn't have a doesn't have a label. Anyway, so I have a nice selection. I think I'll do Wayne's Poo. I'll show you gummy bears and I don't know. 
think I'll show you Cinderella, but I don't know which one has Cinderella. Um, oh, great. I think both of these show you Cinderella. I'll just do these three. How's that? Anyway, this, this is a very cool toy from the 70s era, so I love it a lot. I think this one is Cinderella. I'm going to just do this one. Yep, I was right. Let's see if I can... Nope, I have to... There. I have to bring it down. And it's hard to get the camera in this together, but there we go. That's the best I'm going to do. So you can see... It's still blurry no matter what you do. It's going to be blurry. There she is. And so like, these just don't come out that well. They're just not going to be very clear because they are old. You know, they're very old film strips. And she's dancing with the prince and she's on the... And go backwards. And then she goes backwards. Ah! And she goes forwards. <laughs> and she goes really fast. <laughs> See, it was really you know, a lot of things they could do with this. I just wish it came in clearer, more clearer. I really can't get it in clearer than this. I'm trying. Whoa, it's too fuzzy. That's the only frustrating thing. I love for it to be clear, but it's not going to be. And they got married at the end. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Is that one? I'll do the gummy bears. Now. Oh, I showed my daughters this. And they said about... I don't want this to hurt your eyes. I. Uh, they said about the same thing about it. They, one of them said... Yeah, but there's no music. There's no noise, like sounds. You only hear this the sound of the little thing turning. I'm like, yeah, they didn't do stuff like that. You know, they did. I'm not saying they didn't have movies, but they didn't make a toy that did that back then. You know, <laughs> they just complained about how hard it was to turn the crank. Like, my arm's getting tired. And, <laughs> you know, why, why watch this when you have, you know, YouTube, when you can just watch whatever you want? <laughs> But I'm like, that's not the point, you know, that's not the point of it. <laughs> uh, but it's fun. It is funny, though. It It's amazing what we're used to now and hard to believe things were like this back then. But this is pretty cool for its time. The fact that you could watch a little segment of a movie by yourself, even if it didn't have, you know, sound, that was still pretty cool. So, yeah. This is the Gummy Bears. I never really watched it much. So I don't really know what this one's about, but yeah. He's getting strong. He's looking it up. I don't know. I don't know what he's doing. He's hanging off the edge. Roar. Yay! He saved the day or something. <laughs> I honestly don't know. Okay, one more. How about we watch Tigger? Check Tigger out. I have to put it in the right way. I gotta fix the clear thing. It's about as good as it's gonna get, I think. So, there's Tigger. Bounce, oh, bounce, bounce. Of course, I can't read that. Climb the tree. <laughs> so that's it that's it fun stuff anyway so that I guess will do it for um, my throwback Thursday of the Fisher Price movie viewer theater and also the single you know for single use movie viewer very very cool and it's time for sure so and all those cassettes <laughs> 
So it was a nice um, blast from the past for me anyway. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it came out good enough. But I didn't know how many people watching my channel would know what that was or even have seen one before. So I just wanted to share it. So it's pretty cool. I actually can't wait to try it on a wall sometime. But I might need to get a new light, uh, light bulb. I don't know if... Because it seems like it's still a little like dim. I don't know if I might need to buy a new light bulb. I'm going to check it out. But anyway, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. And if you like this video, you can give it a thumbs up. You can subscribe to my channel. I do toy openings, toy reviews, crafts, lots of things related to toys. And I'm trying to get back to doing uh, Throwback Thursdays where I showcase vintage toys and retro ones. And yeah, so thanks so much. Everybody have a wonderful day. Keep having fun. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye, guys.